She might be younger than you are, she might be shorter than you are, but you better not get in Nazifa Rahman's way. She started volunteering at the Ability Society when her brother Ridwan was diagnosed with autism. Her enthusiasm and drive led her to eventually become the youngest employee ever hired by the Ability Society. She volunteers at Youth Central, she sits on the Conical Phillips Youth of Distinction Awards, and as her high school president, she raised money for Free the Children and the Kids Cancer Care Foundation. All of that before she's out of her teens. Well, the first time I met Naz, I came into the Crescent Heights School and I was running the YVC program there. And I just noticed that her leadership and her willingness to have ideas in the club. She's a very passionate young lady and it's that passion that drives her into doing the things that she does. So Naz was our student council president, but it wasn't what you traditionally think of as a student council president. Her goal was to create a mini we day in our school, which is where you bring in speakers and positive role models and you bring in the talent. So Naz spoke about her role as a mentor and, and wanting to make the change in, in the beliefs about children with special needs. When you meet her, she's such an empowering leader. You would never think of it because she's so small. Like she's actually the smallest, cutest little girl ever. But like when you see her, she can totally command a room and youth will listen to her because she's humble and she's genuine. As his brother, well, he's disabled. He has severe special needs um, and Naz looks after him. She takes care of him. She wants to be helpful. She's a good sibling because she's always looking for that. Um, I'm not going to do it for you, but here's how I can help you. I really saw the impact this year when I had my first initial meeting for who wants to be on council and I had over 140 students show up and when I talked with a lot of the kids a lot of them said Naz just really made an impact on me and I wanted to I want to follow in her footsteps I want to do what she did when she is presented with something it's not ever done halfways it's always done to expectation and then some because she's so passionate about what she's doing. 